Hello. My name is Ricardo Valls, and as a geologist with over four decades of experience in the mining industry, I've always been fascinated by humanity's attempts to penetrate the Earth's crust. Deep drilling projects represent some of the most ambitious scientific endeavors ever undertaken, pushing the boundaries of our technological capabilities and our understanding of our planet's inner workings. Let me share with you the stories of the three deepest drillings ever made and the plans for future explorations. The undisputed champion of deep drilling is the Kola Superdeep Borehole, located on the Kola Peninsula in Russia's Arctic Circle. This remarkable feat of engineering reached an astounding depth of 12.2 kilometers. The Soviets began this ambitious project in 1970, driven by Cold War competition and scientific curiosity. As they drilled deeper, they encountered numerous surprises that challenged our geological understanding. One of the most intriguing discoveries was the presence of water-saturated metamorphic rock at great depths, where free water shouldn't exist according to prevailing theories. The extreme pressure had likely squeezed hydrogen and oxygen atoms out of the surrounding rocks, forming water molecules. This finding has significant implications for our understanding of the Earth's crust and potential water resources. The COLA project also yielded another surprising discovery. Microscopic fossils found as deep as 6.7 kilometers below the surface. These fossils, representing 24 distinct species of plankton, were remarkably well-preserved despite the harsh conditions of heat and pressure. Such findings challenge our assumptions about the limits of life and the preservation of organic matter in extreme environments. The second deepest hole is the Bertha Rogers Hole in Oklahoma, USA, which reached a depth of 9.6 kilometers. Drilled in 1974 by the Lone Star Company, this oil exploration well achieved its impressive depth in just over 500 days. However, the drilling came to an abrupt halt when it struck a molten sulfur deposit, which solidified around the drill string and broke the rig. This unexpected encounter with molten sulfur at such depths provides valuable data about the thermal and chemical conditions deep within the Earth's crust. The third deepest drilling project is the German Continental Deep Drilling Program, KTB, in Bavaria, which reached a depth of 9 kilometers. This project, initiated in the early 1990s, aimed to study the junction of two tectonic plates. The scientists faced significant challenges, including unexpected temperature spikes and drill deflection. Despite these setbacks, the KTB project provided crucial data about the structure and composition of the Earth's crust in a tectonically active region. As for future plans, the quest to reach the Earth's mantle continues. The Japanese-led project 2M Hole, under the International Ocean Discovery Program, IODP, aims to recover mantle rocks in situ. This billion-dollar initiative represents the next frontier in deep drilling, with the potential to revolutionize our understanding of the Earth's interior. The location for this ambitious project is likely to be in the ocean, where the Earth's crust is thinner. Drilling through the oceanic crust could potentially allow us to reach the mantle with less drilling than would be required on land. However, the technical challenges of deep sea drilling are formidable, requiring specialized equipment and techniques to withstand the extreme pressures and temperatures. As we continue to push the boundaries of deep drilling, we're not just exploring the physical limits of our planet, we're also testing the limits of human ingenuity and technological innovation. Each new project brings unexpected discoveries and challenges forcing us to revise our understanding of the Earth's structure and composition. The future of deep drilling holds immense promise. As we develop more advanced drilling technologies and improve our ability to withstand extreme conditions, we may finally achieve the long-held dream of reaching the Earth's mantle. This would provide unprecedented insights into the formation and evolution of our planet, potentially revolutionizing fields from geology to planetary science. In my career, I've seen how each drilling project, whether for scientific research or resource exploration, contributes to our collective knowledge. The lessons learned from the Kola Superdeep Borehole, the Bertha Rogers Hole, and the KTB Project continue to inform current and future drilling endeavors. As we stand on the cusp of potentially reaching the mantle, I can't help but feel excited about the discoveries that lie ahead 
waiting to reshape our understanding of the world beneath our feet. And that will be all for this new episode of Geo Voices. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and tell your friends about the channel. Until next time. My name is Ricardo Valls. I am a professional geologist registered in the province of Ontario, Canada, and also the president of Valls Geo Consultant. Geology, geochemistry, structural analysis, machine learning, and artificial intelligence, I am sure you will find something useful among my over 550 videos. I think these videos are brilliant, and I'm sure you will like them too. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to click the notification bell.